Alright guys, Johnny Dallas back on the helm here. Going to teach you how to do dual monitors with Mac OS X today because all the tutorials that are out there suck wang. Here we go. What you're going to do is you're going to go to System Preferences. You hit System Preferences. You come over to where it says Displays. You hit Displays. You're going to get two things that pop up. I've already set mine so i got to go retrieve this. But either on you know your main monitor or the secondary monitor you're going to have two. This is my cinema. This is uh, my primary monitor. This is actually uh, a Mac monitor that came with the Apple computer. And this is the additional VGA monitor. Alright, so what you're going to start out with is it may start you out with something up in this range, 800 to 600, whatever the case is. What you want to do is you want to go to the internet real quick. And you're going to pull up your monitor. Mine is an Acer uh, 250, it's a G205. So we got G205 HV and uh, Max Res. Take a look at it. Here's our stats. And uh, basically, what it says is I'm looking at 16 by 900 and 60 uh, hertz. So those are my parameters I'm going to use. I'm going to go ahead and minimize this. Go over to my VGA. Take a look. See what I got here. And it looks like when I get down to the 1600 range, I don't have 16. Um, by 900 because maybe that's just not a resolution that uh, OSX supports. So I'm going to go ahead and press it to 16 by 1024 at 76 hertz. And uh, you know some people are going to argue with you about this and say, oh, you know the monitor can't take it. But the bottom line is, does the monitor work? Does it look great? And is the refresh rate fine for playing video? And I've tested this. Obviously, mine's good to go. It's a little bit outside of parameters, but don't worry, it's not really going to hurt it. Click this, and uh, you know then I can set it up so that if I go to my arrangement. Here we go. This is my cinema, or this is this is my new VGA monitor right here. This is my cinema monitor. You can tell because of the uh, um, the uh, the header right here in the very top with the white line. This means that this is your primary. So you can take these, adjust them. You can switch it so that you can go from here outside to the right and get to the monitor to the right hand side. If you take your VGA monitor and you want to put it on the left hand side, and then it reformats it so that you can go left to get to it. Um, Either way, you're, you're all set. Go back to displays, checking out my resolution for my cinema monitor, 1680 by 1050. That's as high as I can press that. I'm going to go retrieve the uh, VGA display here again. This should pop up. It's either going to be on this screen or the other screen. And uh, don't forget, as far as arrangement, um, mirroring display will basically be the same thing on both screens and it's uh, that's that's not really what you want because basically you know if the monitor the Acer monitor that I have over there is a different size it's a different resolution it's a different setup so avoid this button uh, unless you want to see exactly what's on the main screen on the other screen um, yeah that's pretty much it get off of this is there anything else display boom arrangement we took care of that color you can calibrate um, I just use the, the display profiles and then as far as options you can check all this stuff uh, you know to your likeness but that's it